Hi, Jesse Nebula's here. Welcome to Kinseed, which is a game I haven't really played. I checked it out a little bit when it was early access, but I didn't really play it much. Um, it's a life sim RPG sandbox, and it sounds like a lot of fun. Let's just get into it. New game, who am I? I'm guessing that's a girl and that's a boy. Maybe. No, that's a boy. That's a girl. Okay, I was way off. He had, he's got fantastic hair. Um, good, I can change it because I didn't like her head. I can have pink hair. Best game ever. Okay, we're going to go with that. And you can change your skin color. That's fantastic. I can be super pale. I don't want to be quite that pale, even though I'm almost that pale in real life. This will work. Next. What is your name? My name is Jesse. Begin. There was an old woman who lived in a shoe. This sounds she had familiar. So many kids, she didn't know what to do. Then one day, a man without wife or child came to the house with manner so mild. The man looked at the children, each a fair twin. I am your uncle, he exclaimed with a grin. He took them away to live in the Vale. In the land of Quill, the place of our tale. Then they slept, safe, warm and dry under the watchful stars in the sky. Very nice art. I like it. Someone named Pot wants me to wake up. Pot usually doesn't make me wake up. <laughs> Does the opposite. Okay, I'm awake. I'm going around. I like the art style. It's very nice. Very bright, though. Okay, this must be popped. Hello there, dreaming one. Name is Pot. Let's have some fun. I was given a special task. Some intriguing questions must be asked. Step through the door with a brave face. Enter the very special place. I will meet you and give you some choices, so listen to your inner voices. Go on a child and don't be glum. Visit the woods of what's to come. Then when you're awake and we must part, the truth be known inside your heart. Okay, rhyming man. The woods of what's to come. Now let us start this audition. Tell me, child, your life's ambition. Run a business, raise a family, adventure, follow fate. Um, raise a family. That sounds good to me. How do I choose it? Oh, you just walk through there. Got it. Raise a family. Family, eh? I wouldn't know. How would you like to see them grow? Hmm. To spread joy. That sounds nice. A legacy you hope to grow, but remembered for, I must know. Deeds I did. Diamond pendant. Okay. Questions done now. Very good. I can see why Fairweather likes your blood. He gives this gift, so hold it tight and wait for his call one misty night. 
I apologize, that's my cat making noises. Okay. Ooh, a gift is coming down the river. I better wake up and get it. Glass lens, a mysterious gift. There you are. Come over here. You come over here. How about that? Hello, lazy bones. I've been looking all over for you. Dreaming by the stream, eh? You were calling out my name, which is how I found you. I'm just glad you think of me. Set name. Oh, what's my sibling's name? Um, his name's Joshua, because... We're twins, and that was supposed to be my name when my parents thought I was going to be born a boy. <laughs> Weird dreams, huh? You should hear about the one I had last night, but not now. We're supposed to be doing our chores, remember? And don't pretend you lost your journal, Lazy Bones, because I have it right here. Pick a dandelion, feed the pig. Dandelions are the clocks of quill. Find these fluffy little fellas all over the land and pick one. You will notice a clock up here. Simply look at the largest seed to see where it points. Nobody knows what that, how that actually works, but shh. <laughs> okay, fair enough. Set that away. Well, I don't know what that means. So you notice the job added, huh? Well, it is your turn. It's right there on the calendar. I check mine every day to make sure I don't forget things. And maybe when you have time to work on that map you're always going on about. Thought you might like it with you. Alright, looks like I have to open up the map more. I almost forgot Uncle Bill got us a satchel each so we can carry anything we need. They're a bit old and musty, but they're ours. We never had anything like this back at the shoe. Inventory. Fruit and veg, fish, herbs, cooked food, miscellaneous. Seeds, tools, hey, I know it's written veg, lore books. Alrighty, interesting. Anyway, I think that's it. Maybe once you've finished your choice, you can start exploring. Can't wait to have adventures myself. I mean, isn't this place amazing? I still can't believe we're here. I always daydream some relative would show up one day and take us away from the shoe, but I never thought someone like Uncle Bill could really exist. Oh, that's right, he wanted to talk to you about something. Better pop over to the house and see what it is. Okay, I've got to meet Uncle Bill. First, I want to pick a dandelion. Oh, there's a book. What is the was it? What was it? By Amos Seawall. Yeah, I'm not going to read all that. <laughs> it's just not happening. Can I get that apple? I can have that apple. An apple a day keeps the doctor away. Just throw them at him. Fair enough. Get a pear. Just the one. Instead of a pear. <laughs> I get it. That's pretty clever. I like it. Okay, what are you? What are you? Well, can't catch them. Another book. The Pig Rider's Guide to the Galaxy by Bugless Adam. <laughs> uh, in other words, Hitchhiker's Guide to the Galaxy. That's that's nice. Nice outhouse. Can I go in? Okay. I can go in. It doesn't seem to do much for me. This is so pretty. Okay. Map stone. Uncover all the map stones in a level to magically acquire an image of the whole region. Okay. And it kind of looked like that floaty thing was guiding me to it. So maybe... Maybe those guide me to things. Kakudu. Kakudu, the healer's friend. Its usefulness knows no end. Look at the seeds of the dandelion flower. They point to the current hour. Oh, found Stonehenge. Alrighty. Pretty sure the real Stonehenge doesn't do that. But does nobody's mentioned it to me. 
Trader, What Traits Are, by Apply, or Apply, but A-P-Y, Apply. Hmm. What are those strange little symbols you see above people's heads when you gift them items? Why, it's a trade, of course. Most consumables will apply a trade to the consumer that can affect stats, affect their personality, even cause a reaction. You can check what these symbols mean on the character status screen by viewing yourself or the NPC affected. Highlight one for tooltips. There are permanent traits and temporary. Many traits have an opposite, which when applied will cancel out the active one. Up to three traits can be active at once on any living thing. Use these to your advantage. Someone too good at bartering? Lower their barter stat. Want some fun? Want some fun? Apply flatulence. Now go be. Now go have fun out there. Too much reading. But yeah. It's interesting. It's good information to have. Can't leave yet. Okay. Found another book. Clear as Folk. <laughs> By Barrel O' Laughs. Nice. I like, ooh, I found a dandelion. I like that the game developers have a sense of humor. Picking dandelions will make a clock appear in the top right of the screen if you don't already have a clock there. The largest seeds point to the current hour. If it is, if it points straight down, it is six. A dandelion clock lasts 12 hours, so you will need to pick another. A better clock may be available later, but for now, nature can help you out. Okay, I completed my task. I picked a dandelion, so it said straight down would be six. So it is six, seven, eight, nine. Okay, so it's about nine in the morning. Is this another stone that I have found? Oh, okay. Discover all the map stones at a single location. Alright, cool. Got an achievement for that. Hobtooth gives you oomph for night, but also gives you scaredy fright. Okay. Oh, there's a pig. I think I have to feed him. Happy Pets are Productive Pets by Pat Doghead. <laughs> uh, wooden Bucket. Never drink from this. Um, I'm guessing that's for the poo. Yeah, use a wooden bucket to scoop up the poo. Interact with the pig and choose the feed option, then an item to feed it. Okay. Feed truffles, I guess. Um, have an apple. Okay, this mood seems better. And it said ride. I totally want to ride. <laughs> uh thrown off due to unhappiness. Oh, you don't like me, pig? I guess I have to feed it more. Do you want another one? Have a pair. Okay, seems a little happier with me. I don't see any poo to pick up, so... I guess I won't do that. Oink. Alright. Mailbox, nothing. Nothing in there. Oh, I didn't even notice you. You must be my uncle. Talk to Uncle Bill. How are you settling in? I hope you're not finding the tourists too much of a bother. I'm not as young as I used to be, so I can't do everything myself. So is that why you got us? Just to help you out? That's kind of crappy. Not that's why I brought you here. Oh, <laughs> Me and your aunt always wanted children, but we were never blessed. If only she was here now. She always loved this time of year. The festival summertide is coming up, and the whole of the Vale will be preparing for it. Us too. We need the goddess Druida to smile on us and bring us prosperity. So I'm counting on you both to help. It'll be fun. You'll see. Um, how are you? I'm okay today. Thanks for asking. What's happening? Someone needs to milk the family cow, so I'm going to do it. Okay, goodbye. Okay, there's cooking. You can use this when you are older. Okay. A lantern. A light in dark places. Okay. Another book. You have specialized. You have specialized by Tilly Tender. 
animal control for village idiots. <laughs> Do I have anything to gift him? I have an apple. Did he like that, or...? Thanks, I suppose. Well, if you didn't like it, give it back. Those barrows in Rivermore are scary. Apparently, if you try to stay the night in one, the spirits tell you to bugger off. There are whispers that the dead meet there to dance. I can't imagine such a thing. I reckon if you saw that, it would be a thriller. Goodbye. Okay. Saw a new letter in the mailbox. Okay, I'll do that in a second. It was nice, Uncle Bill, to leave little signs around to help us. You should try reading by interacting or using lecture here. I know you can read. I already did all that. I'm good, thanks. What's happening? Not much is happening. Goodbye. I don't have anything to gift him either. Okay, letter in the mailbox. Gift from Uncle Bill. Your friendship means a lot to me, so I'm sending this gift as a thank you. Warm regards, Uncle Bill. An apple. <laughs> I already gave you. I gave him an apple and he gave it back. Of course, it's a nicer apple than the one I gave him. What is it? What is that? No, come back here. Like a blueberry. It's just their color. color. They are not sad. <laughs> How about strawberry? Or raspberry, maybe. Strawberry. Forever in fields full of beetles. <laughs> This game is delightful. Well, we can pet Butterscotch the cow. Oop. Found some poo. I'm trying to pick up the poo. Ew! Does it have to make that noise? What do I do with it? Empty it in here, maybe? Okay, that seems about right. Feed truffles a blueberry. Maybe he'll let me ride him without throwing me off. What's the nose mean? <laughs> oink, oink, oink. Wonder if I found everything that I need to find. This is definitely much faster. How do I get off? <laughs> um, okay, tab seemed to do it. No seeds to plant. Okay, we're gonna ride you again. Ooh, more fruit in the trees. I should probably get that. What's this? Night berries only appear when nine dark bells ring so clear. Okay. Can't get in there. Discovered homestone. Okay, Willowdown Farm. Item permission granted. Okay, it looks like it just kind of tells us how everybody is doing. Wonder why he's only got two hearts. Hmm. Let's get some more of these. Quite expensive due to inflation. The gassy apple. <laughs> okay. Ooh. Dreamer's Nook. Found another map stone. See your map of the region. Okay. Cool. Should have brought the pig. It's getting late. 
Most NPCs can be married no matter what gender. The only exceptions will be those who are goddess blessed like masters. Oh, that's cool. It's the right angle by Rod Polar. <laughs> okay, fishing. That's why it's called Rod Polar. I like it. The Doctor Who fishes. <laughs> that's pretty funny. Ooh, can I go in there? No. I want to go in there. It looks pretty cool. Twigs torn out diary note. Oh, feeling sleepy. I should probably head home then. What's this? This is the brownie bowl. Pot the brownie looks after your house and babies while you are away, but requires reward. Each day you need to place an item in the bowl. This item can be anything. Forget to make an offering, a pot will give you a little curse. Each day he will add another to a maximum of six. These curses are one day of forgetting rotten core, apples go rotten on your trees. Two days of forgetting curdle, cows can't be milked on the farm. Three days be lazy, no honey can be taken on the farm. Four days loose lips, fish don't bite in the farm ponds. Day five, bailiff larder has one random item moved at midnight. Six days befuddle, your children can't learn. Making an offering will take the curse level down one stage. Your family can be ordered to make offerings in your place, so don't forget. Interesting. All right. Um, I have an apple. Is my brother in bed? Looks like he's already in bed. I should probably go too. Sleep and save. Children must sleep from 11 p.m. to 6 a.m. Okay. Set wake up. Um, 6 a.m. morning. Sleep and save. There we go. Auto save. Well, that's nice. I like that. Am I dreaming again? I would imagine so. What's that? I want it. Ooh, there it is. Oh. Some kind of seed. Oh, that's less than ideal. Guess I'm having a nightmare. Do you fear the shadows, my child? Do you, Or do you feel them calling you? You should hold them close and listen. The kinseed has chosen you for greatness. We'll speak again as summertime fades and your closed eyes will be opened. Now wake up. Day two, two brass wedding to collect. Zero new tasks added for the day. Pick dandelion, feed the pig. Okay. Ah, you are up. Off into the village, I fear. Don't get lost. Saw a new letter in the mailbox. Okay. Good morning. Sounded like you had restless dreams. A good day's work is best cure for that. If we're going to be ready for summertide, we'll need the farm running at its best, so I need you to buy a new tin bucket in town. Here, three brass should cover it. I've unlocked the west and south gates. Just watch out for old Herbert if you go west. He's not a pretty sight. Oh, and you have a letter waiting in the mailbox. That's already more mail than I've gotten all year. Anytime you have post, you'll see the mailbox red flag fluttering. Oh, and see if a thatter way will help you if you get lost. Simply select set thatter way on a relevant task. Then set press F1 or click on the left stick and the thatter way will lead you to your destination. They are very cute fairies and not shy at all. Okay. I need to buy a bucket. Alright, I'm gonna check the letter and then I'm going to probably end the episode for this one. Dear pal, my name is Twig and I'm inviting you for a visit. I got told you would be a great friend. I live in the nook north of your farm just across the river. My head is right at the top of the nook. You cannot miss it. It's probably what I saw last time. To help me find me, just follow the thatter way. You are bound to have one in your hair. Looking forward to seeing you as soon as we can do some fishing. Your new pal, Twig. Okay, well that's cool. Gotta meet Twig, I've got stuff to do today. Alright, well, I think I'm gonna call that an episode. 
thank you for joining me. I hope you enjoyed the video. If you did, please leave a like or a comment. That would be lovely. And I hope to see you in the next video. I'm Jesse Nebulous. Bye!